Hello, my name is Ned Kelly, chair of the Libertarian Party of Kansas, and here is the deal. This is the deal I am putting forward to all of my executive committee members. Actually, I want to put it out there for any volunteers in the Kansas Libertarian Party, actually the whole libertarian movement, really, local, national, wherever. This is what I am proposing as the deal, what I would hope to expect from you and what I'm offering for myself. So first of all, let us just take it as a given that we are principled libertarians with integrity. I know that may be a lot to assume, but for the purpose of this video, you and I were, were both seeking the same thing, more or less. We want less, a lot less government. We want more freedom. We are in alignment with the non-aggression principle, and we're in alignment, our goals are overall in alignment with the the platform. So let's let's kind of take that out. There, there's plenty of room to discuss all of that. That's that's a whole nother discussion. But for this, let's take that as a given. And what I would ask of you is number one, follow through. So remember, it's a long distance, you know, your activism, your involvement. I, I hope to expect that as a long term commitment, not just a, you know, it's a marathon, not a sprint. Often when we start to volunteer for something or come on board to a board or, or other uh, organization, we're full of piss and vinegar. We have so many ideas and enthusiasm and excitement. And then for whatever reason, maybe the whole situation wasn't what we were expecting. Maybe the people there are not, you know, don't live up to our expectations. That's fair. That's human. Or maybe we just get tired. We, we that's also human. We move on. We get we get uh, focused on something else. So as much as possible, um, think of the the commitment long term, not just short term. I would rather have you follow through on a few things, or even just one thing, than have you promise ten things and not follow through on any of them. I'm going to say that again. So next time you're on a on a conference call, an executive committee meeting, or any sort of get together with others, I would personally, I would much rather have you only promise, only promise one thing and follow through and actually do it than to promise 10 things and not do any of them. So, And of course, the same goes for me. I promise my intention, my commitment is to do likewise and follow through on what I say. Number two, play nice, play nice with others. You know, Respect is key. You know, we can we can disagree with each other and still get along. You know, we don't have to agree on everything. As a matter of fact, it's natural, it's good, it's healthy in an organization if we don't always agree. And let's do so with respect. You know, we don't have to do, go to the ad hominems. Let's listen to each other. I promise uh, for you to listen and, and set that standard along the way. And number three thing that I would expect from you is whatever you want. You know, pick up those things that you're passionate about, that you're interested in, whether it's working on a particular campaign, whether it's door knocking, whether it's writing pieces of legislation and trying to push a legislature, whatever it is for you, whether it's the social aspect and, and, and recruiting other libertarians, whether it's social media, any of that, web design. You know, find those things that you are passionate about and talk to me. Find ways to volunteer. We're going to find ways to get you plugged in. And one additional, actually a couple of additional things I'm going to uh, promise uh, for you. It's all of the above. You know, I'm going to, I am, my, my intention is that I follow through and it's a long-term deal, not a short-term deal. I play nice with others. And communication, communication for you and, uh, and all that we do. I, I'm going to uh, let you know what I'm doing, what my plans are. I'm not going to just start doing some crazy things without letting uh, the, the board and actually the whole body know where my head is at, what I'm thinking along the way. And I am here to listen. I promise to take your ideas, your interests, and treat them uh, as sacred ground. You know, So if you come to me with an idea, something you're interested in, I'm not, my first reaction is not going to be, well, here's why that won't work. You come to me excited about something, that's not going to be my initial response. Oh, here's why, here's what's wrong with that. No, my initial response will, will probably be, wow, that's an interesting idea. T 
tell me more. Tell me more about that. It, it, it'll at least be that. It'll, it, it might be, yes, let's go and do it. it. It might be we'll have to think about that some more and investigate that. But I'm going to take whatever you come, whatever you come with and, and treat it as sacred because that's your passion. That's from your heart. So that's the deal, my friends. Tell me what you think. If there's more to the deal that we should add, what, whatever uh, is on your heart and on your mind, again, I will, I will treat it with respect and I will, I will take it sacredly in this mission, in this journey for peace.